Hey everybody, what's up? Rod here, and welcome back to another Genshin Impact reaction video. Today, we're going to be checking out Nilu's teaser and demo, since she was already a previously released character, and I haven't reacted to her yet. Um, pretty excited. I've actually wanted to try and pull for her for a long time, but she unfortunately fell right before Purina came out, and I really wanted to get her, so I saved then, and then she had a rerun when Baiju was out, and I wanted him, so unfortunately I haven't a chance, so I'm going to try and go for her. Uh, hopefully it works out well, but let's go ahead and jump into the video, shall we? <clears throat> She's so adorable. Love her. To me, Zubair Theater is a home away from home. <laughs> oh, that looks so good. Ugh, I love when they show food. How are the props? I did some fixes and touch-ups. Oh, they were great. Thank you so much, Miss Nadia. <sighs> it's so over. lovely. Now I don't have to hear Mr. Zubair yelling at me every day. Oh, he's just a worry ward is all. Don't lose heart. Everyone loved your performance. Huh? Oh? Hey, get back here, Buster! Swa! Aw, here you are. Who's a good doggy, huh? <laughs> oh, come here. Oh. <laughs> Have you been eating some extra treats? I can barely lift you anymore. Every day spent with the theater is a day full of bliss. I order puppers to sleep in. Your movement. <clears throat> You're still not getting it. <laughs> All right. Okay. Sorry. I'm trying finally. Oh, somebody's <sighs> passed out. Gosh, I love her design. It's so majestic. Definitely goes off like she's about to dance vibes. Without everyone's tireless efforts, this special place Some rare music, exist. man. I always oh. wish this show could last a little longer. So beautiful. So beautiful. Thank you for coming to watch our performance. <laughs> She's so stunning, man. I remember when they first showed her, um, <clears throat> like I said, I think it was 3.1, and I was just like, man, at the time I wasn't very interested in Hyper Bloom or anything like that. I didn't really know. I just wanted to heat it because I started my Archon collecting at that point. <clears throat> and, uh, like I said, I just always thought she looked so fun to play, but I never had the chance. And uh, hopefully now I'll get that chance, because I'm on a guarantee, so we'll see what happens. But I just love it. Like, she just she just seems so friendly and just, like, having a good time and just good vibes all around. It's, it's a good time. So this one was called Dancing Grace, but let's go ahead and jump into the demo next. Okay, so this one is called dance of the delicate lotus and i think we'll actually be able to see her dance a little more i thought they were going to show some more in the teaser but i guess they wanted to save that for a story mode probably um but let's see what they got for us in the demo miss nilu will you teach me the dance you came up with in the desert <laughs> slow down first close your eyes and relax Ooh. your body then picture an oasis oh, her nails. in starlight now imagine that you are the water, clear and bright, just like jelly. It's like jelly. To the world, you're invisible. It never stops to notice you. Well, at least she doesn't have socks on like so Ayaka. So you stand up, <laughs> you leap and twirl, and you show them wow. through dance. Wow. Oh, they got her with Xyphos. Okay, I wonder what weapon she was gonna have. Ah, uh, I just love it too because like when they have the sword users and it looks like they're dancing in their animation, like Eula does. Ugh, I'm gonna play more, but you know. A captivating dance is like water about to boil. Quiet whispers grow into a chorus of cheers to make ripples in your audience's hearts. You have to make a big splash. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. I didn't realize it's like a flower from the top. Oh. Oh, she's so majestic, bro. 
I mean, redhead? Come on. <laughs> Absolutely adorable. Pretty amazing, huh? Nilu, mm -hmm. Do you know where the ribbon for tomorrow's performance went? Uh, sure do. I was practicing with it in the desert. I'll, I'll work something out. <laughs> Sounds like she might be a little forgetful about some stuff, too. But man, ugh. She's so beautiful. Holy crap. I like it, too, because... Um, as I was saying, it's really neat to be able to see like a sword user and it looks like they're dancing while they're actually performing the animations um while they're fighting and stuff and like i said i i just always thought that she looked so fun to play but at the time just never really wanted to try for it um because i had another target in mind but i always thought if the day ever came around when i could try then i would do that like i i feel like this is my year of reruns because i got yoimiya i got yaimiko and now i'm going for nilu <laughs> so um <clears throat> That being said, though, Emily is right around the corner. I totally thought she was first half, so, like, when I saw the Natlet preview, I'm like, why is there no Emily um, teaser or anything like that? And it's because she's in the second half, so we'll probably get that here in, like, uh, 20 days or so. Probably 19 days or something like that. We'll have that for her. So I'm curious to see that, and also, I'm assuming she'll be very well. It seems like a lot of characters we've got that were released right before the next area have done well going into the next area, so I'm very curious to... Uh, see what she's going to be like as well but like i said from what i've seen Nilu looks absolutely fantastic i know it's probably a niche thing for a lot of people they may not be too concerned about doing bloom teams but i always wanted to try it out and i think it'd be fun and gives me another reason to uh, go for kabe as well because he is on her banner he is finally released from the damn basement it took way too long since literally baiju's release now kabe is finally here again so and all honestly even one copy for me would be good because I would put him at C4 to increase his uh, bloom damage by like 60% or something like that. So yeah, definitely. I'm definitely going to try and see what I can get. Uh, I want to wish you guys the best of luck. Hopefully you're able to get her. And also I believe Navia is on a rerun as well. So uh, whoever it is that you're going for, I wish you the best of luck. Hopefully you can get them and get their weapon. But specifically we're talking about Nilu here. So hopefully you can get her. You can get her weapon if you're going for it. It seems very good. A lot of additional HP plus adding EM and all other kinds of additional damage to your other characters and stuff. So pretty damn cool. But as I said, wish you the best of luck. Hopefully she comes home early and get everything nice and save up and start going for whoever maybe you're preparing for in Natlin because I know I already have my target as a Pyro Archon. I cannot wait. I am so excited. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what you guys think about Nilu. Hopefully if you guys have had her already, definitely feel free to, uh, feel free to let me know what you guys think and uh, show me some teams and stats and stuff and let me know what you, guys, uh, what you guys got going on. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do. I would love to have you here. If you want to check out any of those stuff I post, you can check the links in the description. Or if you go over to the playlist page, there's all kinds of stuff for you guys. Thank you so much for your support. Hope you have an amazing day. Take care of yourselves. I'll see you guys in the next one.